Oh, okay. Then we're recording. So, um, next problem was um, because of the oil coming through on the starter plate. So, I've took the mag housing off. She's over there. And we've taken all the bits and pieces off. So, here we've got the main circlip. That looks fine and dandy. Um, first washer. Yeah. Could possibly clean that up a bit better. Um, here's a little spacer that goes on it. Then here's the main bearing, the internal piece, the race, I think it's called. That's still on the crank. Now the crank is still in the engine, but I get some movement with the crank. I can uh, move it slightly up and down. So there's a little bit of play in that. So I don't know if that is meant to be or not, if somebody could advise me. Here's an interesting thing. This is the spacer. Look at that. That obviously isn't how it's supposed to be. But I heated the mag housing up and I knocked it through um, with, I had a piece of wood, a screwdriver kind of thing, big thick screwdriver, hit it through. So I don't know if I've distorted that with heat or whether I did it with the with the screwdriver. But you know, that looks really bad. And then obviously here's the washer. I don't know if you can see that, but that's totally out of shape as well. That's not cylindrical at all. And again, um, it's misshaped. Got a feeling, if anybody can tell me, um, I've got a fear that it could be that the crank has, um, that my crank has bollocksed. So anyway, that's, that's the thing that we're looking at. Um, and if we need to, I can show you what the screwdriver I used to, to bang that out. I don't think it could have misshaped that piece like that, but you never know. Novices can do great things. Um, again, thanks for any help or advice. See you next time.